optional steel base comes as a separate package. Open the packaging carefully and lay out the components. The instructions supplied with your greenhouse detail the components specific to your greenhouse model. See the base diagram and fixing contents table for details. There are two types of corner brackets supplied in the kit. Short corner brackets and long ground spikes. Lay out the components in the correct orientation with the door end facing in the desired direction. Fasten the corners together using the correct bracket for your preferred base. Here where you're using the short brackets to mount to a concrete pad. Fasten using the M10 nuts and bolts supplied. Repeat the process for the other corners. Position your base in its preferred location. Check the door end dimension against the instructions. Ensure the base is square by checking the diagonal dimensions which should be equal. The base must be perfectly level. Once happy the base is square and level, mark the corners and the door aperture opening. Next, identify suitable fixing points and mark the base accordingly. Drill screw clearance holes through the steel base using a HSS drill bit. Once all the fixing holes are drilled, reposition the base in situ using your pre-marked locations. Mark all the hole fixing locations through the base. Remove the base again and using a suitable masonry bit, drill the fixing holes. Fit raw plugs in the holes and reposition the base and using a suitable screw and washer, fix the base securely. Fasten the base down around all the four sides using the same method. Your base is now ready to mount your greenhouse. To mount the base directly to the ground, you will need the long ground spikes. To ensure a secure fixing in the concrete plugs, these ground spikes need to be cut down the angle with a hacksaw and then the ends splayed out. Once the concrete is set around this splayed out ground anchor, the base is restricted from moving up or down. Lay out the parts as previously described and fasten the four ground spikes to each corner. When the base is assembled, position it in its desired location. Once happy with the base location, check the door aperture dimension and the diagonal dimensions using the same method as discussed for the concrete pad assembly procedure. Mark the four ground anchor locations with a cane. Remove the base and dig the four holes to locate the ground anchors. We recommend these holes are dug to a depth of 90 centimeters. Once all four holes are dug, replace the steel base and recheck the base to ensure it is square and level. When happy, concrete the ground anchors into position using standard concrete or postcrete mixed to the manufacturer's recommendations. Recheck that the base is square and level, then leave the plugs to set before mounting your greenhouse. Once happy, you can assemble your Gabriel Ash Essentials Greenhouse onto the steel base. Mm -hmm.